Right. I think that's all we need to do here. Oh yeah, we can check the papers, can't we? Papers! I had no need for junk mail, especially someone else's. Okay, can we check the monitor now? I didn't now? have time to get... No? The safe, safe was on... No. Look at the TV. We didn't do that I decided place. to leave the television switched on. Damn. Alright, nothing important. <clears throat> dee 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 dee. Alright. Let's talk to Dwayne first. He might give us something. Hey, hey Dwayne, Miguel is thinking about killing himself. I had nothing else to. Nope, okay. Straight to the mine corporation. In we go. We know stuff. Give me a detonator. I got a good look at that chart in the police station. It's a map of Cuaramonte. Does it tell us where Ubier is heading? Yeah, a place called Teoculcan. That's the site of the mine. I wonder why they're being so secretive about Ubier's plans. One thing's for sure. If the general's involved, they're up to no good. I'd like to talk to that musician Miguel. Take the detonator and get him out of that jail. Booyah! I shall take your destinies, my dear. Yeah. And can we talk to this dude? Does he have any, anything else to add to this whole conversation? <laughs> I'll just leave. Okay. He probably didn't have anything important to say. So, we needed this, so we give it to him, I suppose. Dwayne! Dwayne! We have detonator! Here is the detonator, Dwayne. Keep your voice down, George! You want everyone to know! You'd best go and warn Miguel that the U.S. Cavalry's on the way! Okay. Hooray! Oh, this walking is so slow. I wish there was a way to speed it up. Alright, let's go talk to Miguel. So slow. Come on. Hurry up. Is there a, is there a, oh God, is there a way to sort of speed it up? It's, it's rather annoying. Audio, audio's not going to change a thing. Screen resolution's going to fuck everything up. Nope. Controls, inventory, characters. Nope. Not a thing. <sighs> hey, Miguel. What is it? What is happening? We're getting out of here. Who's we? They've sent the Delta Force. Nope. The Impossible Missions Force. Don't make me sick. Much better. Who then? A retired greetings card salesman from Ohio. I'm doomed. <laughs> ah, damn. Uh, hello, Ronaldo. You're not the only one. I should have known you'd be trouble the moment I saw you. Look, I can explain everything. Get in that cell. Now. And what if I refuse? He'll shoot you. Okay, here I am. <laughs> going quietly into the cell. There we go. Very wise. Not the Americano scum. One of the reasons I hate guns so much is the way they make people so damned impolite. <sighs> I 
I hope you're enjoying your vacation, Senor Stobart. Ah, go polish your weapon, Ronaldo. <laughs> All right. This was part of your plan, right? Well, in a manner of speaking, no. I was all out of ideas. It was up to Nico now. <sighs> Meanwhile... So, here we are. You've changed. I thought I would slip into something more comfortable. The stench of cheap cologne rolled over me like tear gas. So, what do you want to know about me? Ask and I will answer. I will deny you nothing. <sighs> what are you and OBA planning? That's what I want to know. I am a very giving person. I bet you How are. How nice for your friends. Your eyes are glittering like stars. Is that what is making my eyes water? I was running out of sofa. All right. As spirited as you are beautiful, I admire that. As long as he admired it from afar. Right, what can I do? Swordfish. On close inspection, I noticed that the swordfish was peppered with machine gun bullet holes. The general was a real sportsman, and no mistake. TV! I didn't want to watch a lot of tawdry soap operas. Anything else? Portrait of the man, slash woman. I didn't want the picture. It was a portrait of some thug in a uniform. There you go. Lava lamp! Wish I had one of these. Well, I used to have one. I didn't want the lava lamp. On your look at shit! Lamp, hip in a retro way. I had no doubt the general thought it was hip, full stop. Tiger skin! The tiger was beyond help. A tiger skin lay on the floor. Uh, there's a thing there, but I can't get it up. Oh, fair enough. Da, 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 da. Anything else? Am I missing anything before I talk to this bellend? Nope. Okay, let's talk to this. Lava lamp. Is that a lava lamp? Sure. It's more impressive in the dark. I'll close the blinds. Nope. No, no, don't do that. Not on such a beautiful day. And now he's watching a porno. <laughs> Who's the guy with the hat and the fat cigar? My mother. Ouch. Big fish. Catch it yourself? Catch it? <laughs> Fishing poles are for children. Then how did... Are those bullet holes? Two magazines on full automatic. It put up quite a fight. I... Um... Love your TV. Oh, yeah. Cool, no? Oh, hello. Mom, what is going on here? Uh, nothing, Mom. I was... Uh, 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 I'm in uniform. And when I'm in uniform, it's... Madame la Présidente, sorry. Madame la Présidente. Now, what is going on here? Nothing, Madame la Présidente. I was just showing my friend Nico some of the cool stuff I've got. Hi. Good afternoon, senorita. And just what are your intentions toward my son? Intentions? We were just talking. Oh, nice. She has good bone structure, Raoul. Has she any brains? She's a reporter. Is she? And what sort of questions has she been asking? I'm a freelance photojournalist. I do lifestyle features. For what sort of magazines? It looked safest to play dumb with good bone structure. <laughs> um, Haya, uh, lifestyle of the super rich and vainglorious, Envy magazine. Um... Excellent. Raoul, you've chosen well for a change. Oh it God! Was pretty obvious who pulled the strings around here. I hope George was making good use of the time I was buying him. And then it goes. Fa 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 fa. And when you were in this band of yours, you used to play that song for two hours. Yeah, we were really famous at our college. Still, ours wasn't as good as the original version. I have never heard that song before, yet I have no doubt that this must be true. <laughs> hey. Psst. 
Hey, George! Hello, Dwayne! Dwayne Henderson. Boy, am I ever glad to see you. Get to the American Consul and tell him I've been imprisoned without charge. Get real, George. He was the previous occupant of that cell you're in. We're gonna have to use good old American know-how to get you out of there. Uh-oh. That, and this truck full of explosives I've got here. Dwayne, Dwayne, listen to me. You'll kill all of us. You're such a naysayer, George. It'll go like clockwork. Sure. Uh, negative to negative, uh, uh positive to pos- uh, you gotta get the bare copper wire here. Let me just, uh, ah, got- ah, damn. Alright, I'll just hook that up. All right, there we go. Okay, just a minute. I've got to get to a safe distance. Quick, Miguel, hit the mattress. You have strange customs up north. Here we go! Too late. Boom! Are we dead yet? Horseshit! What happened to the explosives? Wow, language, there ain't Dwayne. No explosives. <coughs> My dumbass supplier must have given me organic fertilizer instead of chemical. All I got here is 400 pounds of lightly fried horse apples. Yummy. That's a lovely image, Dwayne. Never mind, I'll think of something. All right. I think I know what I need to do here. Noose. I couldn't reach the noose. Miguel, give me the noose. Listen to me, Miguel. You give me that rope, and I'll get us out of here. Is there somewhere you can hide from the general? Of course. My friends have a boat ready to take me up river. But how are you going to break out of here with just a short piece of rope? I'm not sure. But I'll think of something. Give it. I know what I'm doing. Dwayne! Dwayne! If your plan doesn't work, will you let me hang myself in peace? Yes, yes, I will. Be I fair. couldn't escape that way. Call Dwayne, you pillock. I didn't have the key to the lock. <laughs> the door was locked. <laughs> right. Solid oh. bars protected the small window. I wasn't getting out that way. Shout, Dwayne! My God! Sis. I wasn't Tug. going to demean myself by using the bucket. Can't really see it, Until I was desperate. Dwayne! I couldn't escape that way. Ah, right, yeah, I get it now. Dirt with dirt. There we go. And Dwayne should show up. There you go. Dwayne! I had nothing else to ask him. Oh, Dwayne! I couldn't escape. <laughs> Rope. And give it Dwayne. Hey Dwayne. Here we go. I want you to tie this rope <laughs> to the truck and then drive forward. I'd had no idea whether this was really gonna work. But I'd seen it in a black and white western. Of course, Hopalong was using a horse and Dwayne had a four ton truck, but hey, the principle's sound. Anything you say, George! Ray! Please forgive my mother. She can be a little difficult. My feet, Raoul! Propose, you idiot! Don't mind her, she just wants grandchildren. <laughs> Don't think I can't hear you, Raoul. I want the worthy successor, and you're not it! Propose now, or I'll do it for you! Wow. Look, Nico, we haven't known each other very long, but... <laughs> what the hell was that? I didn't know what was going on. But Georges had to be involved in it somewhere. Nothing important. Nothing destructive. Oh, okay. I ain't gonna say a thing, cause that sweet sound of falling masonry says it all. Quick, senor. The river. Run! Huh? Wait. What about Nico? Run away! Josh, what have you done? You only had to sneak a look at the job, and it's turned into World War III. No time to explain. Come on. Bit much, Nico. It's only a broken wall. Don't move, terrorist scum. You talking to me, Junior? Yes, I'm talking to you, fat man. And my name's not Junior. 
A word to the wise, Junior. You carry on waving that pea shooter in my face, and the next person who sees it is gonna be your proctologist. Savvy? General, I am happy to report that I have apprehended the terrorists. You idiot, not them. The other American and the French woman. They're the ones. <laughs> We out.